What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable FIFA 23 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com. Next time you guys want to buy your coins and make your team even better, go to the website and type the code DAN to get 6% off your next purchase. Also, if you ever want to sell your FIFA 23 coins, you can go to the same website under the Self Foot 23 coin section. Yo YouTube what's going on and welcome to another video to the channel y'all boys and today we're going to go ahead and review 97 rated team of the season Musiala car looking pretty good I bought him on my account for 2.1 million coins we're looking at a car at 6 foot high medium work rates right foot 5 star skill moves 4 star weak foot 94 pace 88 shooting 92 passing 98 dribbling 81 defending 86 physicality and he has both the finesse shot trait and outside the foot shot trade now for the purpose of today's video we're going to give musiala the anchor chemistry style the reason for that is that we're going to be playing him as a box to box midfielder i know i saw on footband that a lot of people were giving him the hot chemistry style you could give him the hog but for today i want to give him the anchor um basically acceleration gets max style sprint speed goes up to 95 defending goes up to the high 80s physicality goes up to the high 80s as well if not yeah, it goes up to 89 with the strength and aggression goes up to 89 as well. Stamina is maxed out as well, which is absolutely fire, which means this car should last through the whole game, if not even more. Uh, Musiala is going to be playing in the 4 3 2 1. He's going to be playing as a center mid right next to Patrick Vieira. So the thing is that Musiala has five star skill moves, which is absolutely fire. We want to see if there's a potential that this car can be a top 10 midfielder in the game because he's currently going around 2 million coins. I saw a couple people pack him this weekend. Not too much buzz around this card. I've been mainly seeing people hype around in Kunku and Bellingham. Obviously, those cards are, in my opinion, better than this Musiala. But still, we should give this card a fair shot. See what's up with him. I like his future stars early in the year. Good card. We're going to play some Elite Division and see if he's worth the coins. All right, so we finally got a game. We're going against Rat FC. Hopefully, this isn't a sweat because I don't like that team name. Uh, yeah, it's a pretty good team. Pretty good team. Not nothing crazy. This guy that we're playing against, he moved the goalkeeper a little too early, but we do take that finish, man. We do take that. Nice tackle. Very very quick on the ball as we see Nice interception The ball and that's an assist, man. Good play created from Musiala. Let's go. Nice. Yo, ball. Let's go, man. Let's go. Good play. Oh, good tackle for Musiala. Oh my goodness, he cooked him. Unfortunately, he couldn't finish with the weak foot right there. Nice interception. He is through. Oh, I couldn't finish that one on one. We take that tap and we do take that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What a cook. That was a cook. I think we cooked Tarama as well. Great way to end the half, but that was a fire goal right there. Good stuff from Musiala. I was from Bobby that pass, man. Good 
This left stick dribbling from this card is just fire. That would have been a sick goal. Look how quick he is. Look at that burst. Look at that burst. That man Musiala was gone. That's some great pace right there. And a good finish, obviously, with the weak foot. That would have been a good goal from the card. Nice, good defense. Gonna send Mbappe, good pass. Lays it out to Cruyff. Why did Cruyff shoot it like that, man? Look at that pace from the card. Mmm, that was absolutely fire. What an amazing play starting out from the back. Musiala cooking up, up 2-1. to one. All right, guys, and that concludes the play review for 97-rated team of the season, Musiala. Coming around 2.1 million coins by the time I dropped this video. 1.6 million coins on the PC. We played three games with the card in Elite Division. We had five goals and two assists as a box-to-box -box midfielder, which is an absolutely insane return for a midfielder now comparing this 97 team of the season to the 92 future stars which i did like earlier in the year the team of the season gets a plus seven on the pace a plus four on the dribbling and shooting a plus six on the defending and passing and then a plus 11 on the physicality so really nice and noticeable boost from the team of the season compared to the future stars now my experience with this uh, team of the season musiala was actually amazing and way way better than i expected so, so let's get into what i liked about the card which is pretty much everything you know everything about this card is exactly what you want from a box to box midfielder when it comes to the creativity the pace the height the dribbling oh my goodness this card this might be a hot take but for me this card is tied top two with the best dribbling in the game along with that Trophy Titans Zizou. I think Sidon in this card, you could also make the argument for KDB, but this card and Zizou are the two best dribbling midfielders in the game, in my opinion. Like combination with the five-star skill moves, which is a major pro from this card because 99 agility, 99 balance, 97 ball control. With the five-star skills, he feels super smooth on the ball going forward. The creativity is just top, top tier. Uh, the pace, very, very quick. You guys saw in the highlights how he was just outpacing anybody. We're going against top-tier CBs in Elite Division. 97 acceleration, 91 sprint speed goes up with the hot chemistry style. Excuse me, with the anchor chemistry style. Nobody was catching up to him, so the pace was a huge pro from the card. 99 stamina, lasts you the whole game. 92 finishing, five goals in three games. Finishing is a very, very good top-tier probably one of the best finishers in the game that's from a center mid box to box midfielder um up there with like sidan kdb bellingham hullet probably top five if you ask me when it comes to the finishing aspect um the physicality was pretty nice as well he doesn't have a thick body type like hullet or jude bellingham um but it's not fragile either so it's somewhere in the mixed category it's okay uh, defending was actually better than I expected. He doesn't have the best defending stats. It does obviously go up to the high 80s with the um, anchor chemistry style. And he does fairly well. I did like his defensive AI, even though he does have high medium work rates. But he does defend pretty well. Defensively, he's in the right spot. Decent defensive position as well. So I will say it's something to look forward to the car. He does very well defensively. For those of you guys who are questioning, does this guy play good defense yes he does yes he does there's not really much to say about the card that's wrong i don't think there's anything wrong with the card you could make the argument that he's not double five or doesn't have five star weak foot there were one or two opportunities where he did miss but aside from that this card is top tier man this card is one of the best midfielders i've used in fifa 23 it kind of makes sense why he's that expensive honestly um for me he's top 10 no debate he's top 10 top five you could make the argument i'm not even allowed to you guys obviously you got sidan hullet kdb jude bellingham 
Then you got the Yaya Torre. Man, this Musiala, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Like, he might be top five in the game. He's really, really good. I enjoyed him a lot. You guys let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think about this card. For me, top 10 for sure. He could make the argument of being top five. So, Team of the Season Musiala gets a thumbs up for me. And rating wise for this card, he's going to get a 10 out of 10. The reason I'm giving him a 10 out of 10 is because this is exactly what I want to see from a midfielder when it comes to the creativity finishing the dribbling the pace and then decent enough defending and physicality to the point it's good enough because this is a mainly a box-to-box -box midfielder you could play this card as a cam but i think as a box-to-box -box man that's where he's gonna flourish the most so you guys let me know what do you guys think about this card uh thank you guys so much for supporting all the videos you guys are absolutely amazing on the road to 5,000 subscribers i appreciate the support on all the team of season videos that you guys are showing me especially the Cristiano Ronaldo one. You guys went crazy in that one. I really do appreciate it. The next video we'll be dropping will be some Elite Division highlights either tomorrow, Wednesday, or Thursday. So one of these three, three days. And then after that video, we're going straight into La Liga player review. So stay tuned into that. Thank you guys once again. It's been your boy Dan FIFA, and I'm out. Bye-bye.